14. All right. For this cause I bow my knees unto the Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, of whom the whole family in heaven and earth is named, that he would grant you according to the riches of his glory to be strengthened. Now, think about if you were praying like this for the pastors, for the members of the church, you would find that more and more of them are embracing the message. More and more of them are understanding it. They're able to comprehend it and to live by it. It's very important. Pray for them like this. That he will grant you according to the riches of his glory to be strengthened, invigorated with might by his spirit in the inner man. Look at the next verse. That Christ may dwell in your hearts by faith. Oh, hallelujah. That he being rooted and grounded in love may be able, look at that, to comprehend with all the saints what is the breadth and length and depth and height. Here's where I'm going. And to know the love of Christ which passeth knowledge surpasses, okay, 